new brand. Back with Hot Mixology, we're talking made in the shade cocktails. Just cocktails that are perfect after you've spent a day out in the sun, maybe hanging out at the beach, at the pool, or even on your yacht. And uh, hanging out on your yacht as we're talking about that. A hot new brand today, we're talking about nautical American gin. Yes, Dave, so this nautical American gin has been inspired by the soul of expiration, has 15 different botanicals in this gin, Dave, and has these subtle essence and hints of sea salt on the finish with each and every sip, so it really just takes you back there on the boat or by the beach, enjoying your time there in the shade by the pool. And you're right, a premium American gin made right here in the USA, and you know, what's, uh, what's phenomenal about the gin is you can taste the passion and pride with every sip, but also um, the packaging of it. Very unique packaging, as you can tell, nautical uh, American gin on the bottom here. These dots, actually, I didn't know that. If you knew that, this is the Moore's Code for nautical. Oh, I didn't realize you spoke Moore's Code, Dave. I certainly <laughs> do. But also with the bottle, you have something else to point out. Yeah, with the bottle too, it has this flat back design. And this flat back design, Dave, is so as you're on your, on your, on your ship, on your yacht, on your boat, <laughs> on your sailing boat, uh, it actually makes sure that the bottle stays stable through the, uh, you know, as the tips oh, in turn, you know, of the boat, the ebb and flow of the ocean waves. The nautical gin bottle stays upright each and every time. Very unique. I love it. Check it out on hotmixology.com. I'm going to put it on the featured <laughs> brands page so you can get nautical gin into your home, into your bar, and mix up a cocktail like we're doing today. What's the cocktail we're making with uh, nautical All right, gin? Dave. So this cocktail is called the Nautical White Star, and we're going to take a couple slices of cucumbers in here, and we're going to muddle these guys down. And we just want to break them up, release those good cucumber flavors. All right, got that in there. Now we're going to throw in some fresh mint. And like I like to say each and every time, is with mint, you don't want to muddle it. You want to smack it. If you muddle it, it turns bitter. Now we're going to throw in our smacked mint. Now we're going to throw in some fresh squeezed lemon juice. Nice, I can already smell that mint. Oh, and the mint's going to play off so well, along with the cucumber and that sea salt essence you get in this gin. Now we're going to add a couple dashes of orange bitters. And of course, we're going to add some simple syrup. And then finally, Dave, we're going to be adding our nautical gin right in here. Beautiful. And you can smell those amazing aromatics. Remember, you like a juniper, coriander, uh, mint, cinnamon. It's incredible. Yeah, beautiful gin. Great wow. on its own as we were enjoying martinis oh, yeah. with it the other night. Straight by, by glass in itself. So we got everything built here in our shaker tin. We got our julep cups already iced down. Now we're going to liven it up and now rock it to sleep. Every last drop. Beautiful. What do we call this cocktail again? This cocktail, Dave, is called the Nautical White Star. Nautical White Star with the great Nautical Gin. Hot new brand on Hot Mixology. We are talking made in the shade cocktails. Made in the shade cocktails, and join them with Nautical Gin. Oh, a couple of slices of cucumber right here, more for the garnish. Here you go, my friend, the Nautical White Star. The Nautical White Star. We'll be right back on Hot Mixology. Salute, everybody. Salute.